Hi all, welcome back to some EU4. Playing as Muscovy, we are, um, well, we're growing. And my keyboard, oh, my keyboard was just not acting the way it should there for a second. All right, we do have a loan to repay, which is kind of scary. <sighs> Yulia, we'll take you. A ton of money that we're spending on various stuff. Forts. State maintenance. Like our money situation is not as good as I'd like it to be. One thing I have not even thought about playing with is what we've got going on here. We are forwarding that to Novgorod, which is where we're collecting. God is with Yulia. Um, all right. Where are those rebels? Let's see here. You are going to come over here. Go take them out. We're drastically, drastically short on decent generals again all of a sudden. Kind of annoying. I may need more money. It's going to be an issue. You deal with that. Um, good job. I think we're going to hold off on you so I can get Diptech. Hmm. Still have two more rebels at least popping momentarily. Advisors are expensive, but I, my Regency Council is terrible. That should go away relatively quickly, I think. I can go nowhere with these to avoid attrition, apparently. Uh, there we go. It's a little bit better. Well, we knew that was going to happen. I'm a little bit shocked that we lost that fight. All right, getting all the rebels we knew were going to happen. A little bit annoyed that it's all happening at once. But we'll deal with them. Relatively quickly, in fact. Uh, neither one of these are particularly scary stacks. Go that way. It cost us more money. Now I'm really annoyed I took that loan by accident. Uh, <laughs> We are going to... Seriously? Why are you so good? I am better than you in, like, every way, and yet you almost won that. Okay. Well, that sucked. Thought we dealt with a bunch of rubbles. Um, there's our new heir. Really good, in fact. And we're losing six ducats because reinforcements not expensive. Uh, missionaries, really, got corruption is nothing. Fleet is nothing. Ooh. I may need to start like. So I get rid of you. Yeah, let's sack you for the moment just so we can make a little bit of money here. Can Lithuania do that? I guess it can. It's, independent. it's not independent, but it can. England and Scotland, of course. Otherwise, England will be able to get troops over here. That's, that's what I'm worried about. So, gain prestige, that's what I need. Are we fully reinforced? We are. Good. Um, there we go. Another full army. We'll hold there for our army's sake. 
decline. Um, that's annoying. It was actually useful. Take the global tariffs, however. Do I want to get rid of the rest of my forts? I probably do. They cost money. I don't need it. I just need to survive. See here, lose some oil gain for some production. Ooh. That's fine. Where can you stand and still be safe from attrition? Not a lot of places. You're over here, 6.9. How much of this is from yeah, active missionary? Diplotech is awesome. It means we can pop at the military tech when we get it. Um, it's good military tech, too. Okay, we converted you, which should calm you the heck down. Yeah. Which means let's drop our maintenance. Um, let's wait till the Vonians go away and then we'll drop our maintenance which should help us a bunch. We now have no generals. <laughs> oh, goodness. You're growing rather slowly, but there's our military tech. Hussar. Um, but there is nine. 19, 22. Each of was discovered, that's fine. Hold off on the rest of those. Now we can drop our maintenance as much as we want. Try to get that loan repaid. There goes my chair deciding to be angry with me. Um. We still have one fort. I'm not really sure where it is, besides it's our capital fort. Um, which actually means you can destroy that, because you'll still have the garrison. There we go. No more forts. I do not want to build buildings yet. Tax, production, trade. Like, everything else now is... I need to build manpower stuff. We're up. Not quite at 100k yet. Anything I can do to hurt you, I'm going to do. Because um, the alliances around me suck. Um, Grand Captain. Definitely do that one. Hurts our money situation, but extra morale is not bad. Mm -hmm. Still allied to England and Scotland. You are your own thing, Norway. Interesting. Um, let's actually look at that as a potential, because we can take... We could take... I think. Can we walk through here? I think we can. This is not... Uh, not jungle, but like places you can't walk. Wasteland, there we go. Brain! You know, they're like a year before I can actually spend money on anything. Truce of Crimea has extended, or Truce of... Interesting, we could go on down here. That would potentially get Kazan into a war that would be okay save Cossacks over there, and I don't know, they're tiny, okay, Kazan's also tiny, so that's tempting, um, one thing we should do then is build a spy network here, 
because I definitely want to do that. You're taking attrition here. God damn it. Where can I take you guys to stop taking attrition? Go over there. I do not want to worry about marriage you. I eventually want to take you over. Shh, don't tell anyone. It's a full ducat worth of interest, which is impressive. Okay, there we go. Goes away. Astrakhani. Sarai and me. Okay, down there. That's fine. If I could convert, I would. I cannot. Oh, that popped quickly. Jeez. Also, reinforcement. I need to reinforce. I'm taking that much of a hit. Oh, that's ridiculous. Okay, so colonizing is expensive for us, apparently. Our money situation in general is just not great. Oh, the oh my god. I just repaid that loan. Hmm. Okay, there's those. Let's come down here. It means we're going to take another loan because we're gonna, almost certainly going to have to reinforce. That's quite frustrating. Why can you suddenly walk through my territory? Don't particularly want you to. Please just run them over. At least it was just, we just got the front lines hurt. Come back up here. Once you, there you go. Go up there. <laughs> Once they reinforce, we'll drop our maintenance again. We're actually not terrible on money right now. That's good. Two more months, it looks like. Maybe. I hate this, like, diminishing returns nonsense that goes through. It drives me up a wall. You can reinforce very lightly for a little bit. Yeah, we definitely want the Diplotech. Although, military-wise, we're probably okay. Which might mean it's time to start improving here. Like, that's really worth it. And for us, that's one of the things we're going to need to do. Um, like, right there, that probably gave us 2,000 more manpower, just from that spending of points, and we need to spend points to do that. Cool. Cool. Maybe it was just a thousand that we just got out of that, but again, we're gonna have to do it. Production efficiency, extra colonists. Getting a Siberian frontier is really nice, and tech cost isn't bad. But, yeah, for the moment, not the plan. I have no more loans, right? Did I take a loan? No, I did not. So I can start building again, which is an interesting potential. Let's see here. Anywhere. Just plus 10 so far. And I mean, this makes sense, right? Like we need to get our economy back in track. Hmm. You're still alone. Can I fabricate a claim on you? I can. Which is fascinating. Let's go see about... Oh my god. You're both terrible. Okay. Let's go see what we can do about taking some of you. You have 8k troops, so... Should be a relatively easy fight. Um... 
means I need to raise my maintenance. I'm just gonna call it. Let's let's keep on rate. Let's let's wait as long as we can here. And we're gonna lose money because of reinforcements, which is ridiculous. Okay, you know what? I have made armies that are apparently too big for my own good. So let's start moving you guys around to fix that a little bit. Um, stop taking this attrition, that's ridiculous. Um, Leave my reserve army. Good enough. Alright, you. Diplomacy. Declare war. Take. Diplomacy. Declare war. Declare war. Take Finnmark. There's the dip tech that we needed. Perfect. Do have a fortress here, which is kind of annoying. Go there. Um, move you up there. I guess I can start building new armies soon. We've yet to see their troops. They only have 8k, so... How big is Norway? Too big. We're going to want me to take you. Alright, it's fine. Can you get there? No, you cannot. This can only be good. Uh, we'll take the 50. I know there's like a cost issue there that worries me. Money situation is already awkward much of the time, so let's try to avoid any more. Take the land maintenance modifier that will help as well. Oh, look, you have an army. Um, let's go fight that army. You can stay there, troops. Should not be a hard fight. As I was saying, it won't be a hard fight at all. They have a lot more morale than I do, but... Um, wow, that's painful. They do have, like, double their troops, so... Everything here is going to be... a pain to fight against because of all the damn mountains and everything like that, so... It's just going to take us a little bit. That's fine. Troops at the wazoo, and they have more morale than we do. Alright, well, we're definitely going to take some from them. Excellent, good colony. Alright, let's go fight here. Okay, you're not moving anywhere yet. Okay. I do want to see what all I can manage to take from them. Uh, I don't need that much in terms of territory, but if I can get money and reps, maybe, and just steal like two provinces, that could be pretty useful. Um, and if I can keep on taking out their troops like this, we're going to be much better off. There we go. If we can't siege a bunch of these things right now. Yeah, we'll have most of them siege at this point. 
what I want from you. Let's see, those two were reps. Your money. Release Iceland. Yeah. That seems good. Gets us further up. A couple more provinces. They're both threes, so not to be unexpected here. Easy to core. Um, we're going to bring you back this way. You guys can come over here. Um, and you're at 10 4, 4. Perfect. Let's look at the building. More of this. 250s, 250s, 281. Okay, well, we picked up a little bit of Norway. We're going to start curving into the Nordic countries as soon as we can. But for now, we're going to call into it. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.